So, just one more sleep until Christmas, which means just eight more sleeps until 2022 begins. That's a scary thought, isn't it? And normally, a new year brings with it New Year's resolutions and new opportunities and new plans. But January 2022 probably feels quite different for most of us. More of the same old, same old. And maybe you're like me and your New Year's resolution is just to keep going. But there is a reason we can start 2022 with hope when it comes. And that reason is found in the carol that takes the top spot in my Christmas carol countdown this year. My favourite carol, Hark the Herald Angels Sing. And the last verse goes like this. Hail the heaven-born Prince of Peace. Hail the Son of Righteousness. Light and life to all he brings. Risen with healing in his wings. Mild he lays his glory by. Born that man no more may die. Born to raise the sons of earth born to give them second birth. When God's Son came at that first Christmas, he came into a world where each new year brings many of the same old tragedies, including the awfulness of death. There was no death when God first made the world. It was just a scene of life. But that scene of life was shattered when the first humans disobeyed God and sinned. And we've shown the same pattern of sin in our lives. And that sin leads to death and separation from God. But then Jesus was born to bring something new. And the one who was laid in a manger was later laid in a grave like so many others before him. But unlike those others before him, he didn't stay there for long. He rose again to new life, never again to die, risen with healing in his wings. And now he calls us to come and trust in him and to find endless hope in the face of death. That as we come to him, he gives us what that carol calls second birth new spiritual birth into God's family. He gives us new life that is stronger than death. So if we know Jesus, we can start 2022 knowing that we have a secure place in God's family, an eternal place that not even death can take away from us.